What's up everyone? It's Justin here with Tech Journey. On day 40 of my enrollment with Course Careers, I have finally received my certificate of completion. <laughs> Is Course Careers legit? Why did I choose Course Careers in the first place to break into tech? Was the course actually that helpful? And when can I expect to land a job? Stay tuned, I will answer all of these questions. Thank y'all so much for stopping by our channel. While you're here, do us a favor, hit that like button and do consider subscribing to our channel. My wife and I started this channel on September 11th, 2022, after we enrolled in Course Careers on September 10th, 2022. The intent of our channel has been to share our journey into tech with transparency so that you can make an informed decision on one, if tech is for you, and two, how to successfully break into it. Let's dive into question number one. Is Course Careers legit? Aside from seeing that Course Careers is endorsed by a number of influential people, I'm going to give you my personal opinion based on going through the course. So it appears to me that a lot of detail went into the formation of course careers. And this specifically concerns what is actually being taught in course careers and also what resources are provided to a student who's within the organization. How can I put this? As I went through the course, I realized that I'm not as smart, I guess, as maybe I thought I was. That's a good thing. What I mean by that is course careers did not leave any stone unturned. They literally covered every area that I could possibly think of that a person would actually need to know as they're being prepared to move into their role in tech. I mean, at some points, I found myself giving a lot of attention to things that I really didn't see myself giving attention to in the course, like how to actually write a correct grammatical sentence or how to actually know the difference between an adjective and an adverb. I mean, it seems silly, but then when you're being tested on how to clearly communicate to an executive, then it all comes together. I do realize now why it said it's not that simple to break into tech. Well, that's because apparently these companies who are hiring people on in tech they really want you to understand the industry. And if you don't get the proper training for that, I personally really don't understand how you would actually grasp it fully, but I'm sure you can do a lot of homework and research on your own if you like to. So to answer the question, yes, I believe Course Careers is legit. To go along with that, I've also met people who've actually went through course careers and now have landed a job in tech. Now let's move to the next question. Why did I personally choose course careers to break into tech? Let me start by saying this. Course careers obviously is not the only schooling that you can go through to actually get into tech. There are other boot camp like courses that are available, or of course, you can always go and get a full college degree. Before I get into why I chose course careers, in the event you're wondering why someone would choose a course other than course careers, I'll give you two of my friends' contacts. The first is a friend of mine who was wrapping up his course with careerists as a sales engineer in training. And the second friend currently works as a sales lead development representative, and she went to school through SV Academy. I'll leave both of their LinkedIn links in the description below if you care to reach out to them and get some feedback from them. Just being real, a primary reason why I chose Course Careers is because it was $450 for the course with a coupon. My wife and I weren't sitting on a large lump of cash, so we just decided, hey, why not just pay the 450, enroll in a course that seems pretty legit, and then from there, 
will have the ability to get promoted or move in different areas in the tech field once our foot is in the door. We had the awareness that the starting pay for the first year was about sixty to eighty thousand dollars, and also we could work from home. So to us, that was enough motivation to just pay four hundred and fifty dollars. Let that be our starting pay at least. We can work from home, and then we can potentially quickly move through the rankings once we're in. Now, let me be clear. You do need to understand exactly what role in tech Course Careers is preparing you for. Course Careers offers two tracks. One is an IT track, which my wife and I did not take. The other track is a tech sales track, which prepares you for the role of SDR or Sales Development Representative. Now, this is the entry level position into tech. And SDR is the one who finds the prospects for the company. They're the ones that do the homework. They identify who would be a good fit to benefit from whatever product or service their company offers. And then the SDR reaches out to them. And then after they reach out to them, the SDR sets meetings with them and then basically qualifies them to ensure that they are a great candidate to move forward in the sales process. Was the course helpful beyond what I expected? Let me share something with you. Being trained as an SDR has allowed me to help a number of people get into course careers already. The training has also helped us greatly expand our YouTube channel in just a short amount of time. Let me explain. I've learned how to become less self-centered and more focused on what will actually benefit the person in front of me. This has enabled me to put out content that I believe makes a difference in a person's life as well as I have been able to more effectively communicate with those who reach out to us asking for help. You see, being trained as an SDR through course careers has radically shifted the way that I view sales. And I have learned quite a bit in sales coming from selling new and used cars. And the dealership that I work for is a very credible dealership. So for me to have such next level thinking has been an eye opener for me. I feel like if I can grasp my role as an SDR with excellence, then I can bring a lot of value into other roles as I move into different positions in tech. When can I expect to land a job now that I have graduated from course careers? Well, of course, that varies from person to person, but here's my plan. I'm going to take the next few days really studying the interviewing process that course careers prepares you for. I'm also going to take the next few days to continue to tweak my LinkedIn profile which a lot of hiring companies will be looking at. Yes, Course Careers prepares you for this as well. So maybe anywhere from four to eight days, I'll begin to heavily apply for companies. And hopefully I will have a job within the next three weeks or so. But don't worry. We'll keep you posted. Well, if you have stayed on the video this long, then it's safe to ask you to hit that subscribe button. If you have any questions, we would love to help you. Just send us an email. And until we meet again, enjoy your journey.